Yeah. I see, uh, I know he has a Diddy Kong that he uses every now and then. I've seen that more in this Pac-Man. Yeah. I, uh, so what I'm wondering is, a lot of Pac-Mans I know think that this matchup is just hot garbage. Really? Yeah, they think, like, Mario just runs all over Pac-Man. Well, I'm not sure I agree. I, yeah, I don't agree either. I mean, I think that Pac-Man has a really good keep away game. And like he's at a he's he's kind of floaty, so he he isn't gonna get comboed for like ever, you know. That's he's true. at like a decent weight, so I could see him being able to get out of combos. And his keep away game is just like really good. His up B is such a great tool to have. Exactly, too. that frame one up B definitely useful, especially for getting out of those uh, combos from Mario when you only have a couple of frames to like get out of there. Having a frame one move that'll just jet you out of there is really key. We're seeing Mario have kind of a hard time getting in though. Yeah, and that's exactly what I would have like expected. I I didn't wouldn't think it's impossible but definitely difficult and uh, that's what you have to go for really. yeah oh, oh man, and just a raw up smash a AEX had his whole charge flood there and he had uno in free fall and he could have had the stock oh, oh but there he makes oh up for it. He very makes up good for awareness it. yeah he was like i'm not letting that go by twice like i missed one i'm taking the second yeah. one and that's actually that is very interesting now that i think about it because we were just talking about how the upbeat can be really useful yep but, but if, 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 if on yeah stage, you just get him wet yeah exactly that's a Uno's definitely going to have to be really careful, but definitely not going to count him out just yet. I, I know that um, Pac-Man can rack up a surprising amount of damage really quickly if he gets a couple of projectile hits. That's true. Him. Now, Uno, again, another one of our PR players. I believe uh, number seven, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I believe he is. He dropped down to eight. Okay. Um, but yeah, def like regardless, very, like, need to watch out for him. Oh, he yeah. knows his stuff. 6WX's brother, too. Yeah. Good Nair. Get him off stage. And that's, like... My, like it's the thing trick. that I think is going to be a key Ooh. in this matchup is like, Pac-Man. I don't, I don't see a good way that he can really edge guard Mario. I mean, I know Mario's recovery with like the invincibility on the up B is like, um, it's kind of difficult to gimp, but I don't really see like how Pac-Man can really provide any pressure against Mario when he's off stage. I mean, it seems like Matt's just recovering for free. Yeah, there's not much you can do, mostly because if uh, the Hydra's falling on top of you and you just tap it with a hitbox, you go right through it. So Mario yeah. can up be right through it. Yep, and um, ooh. And that was a good job of delaying the, um, his fall with the Hydrant. I know Matt was probably looking for that up smash, so that was good stuff. That was nice very And I have to okay. think he... I know Apple, the Apple can... Ooh, oh, good catch. That right. I was about to say. The Apple, if he can get another one, will definitely kill now. It's uh, surprisingly strong. Um, but a back throw, I think, will probably do it from almost anywhere. Um, maybe not across... Oh, and oh. there's the Apple. He's going to take the first stock and going to... Get the Galaga ready. Maybe try to get a nice string going. Oh, are we gonna go for the gap. Japanese Vine combos? That's yeah. happening. Are we gonna go on Vine? No, no. Nope, Ooh, on vine. good. Uh, just outside of the range of that forward smash. That was really close. But Matt is doing a good job of not letting Uno get comfortable. He's like, okay, you got that stock, but don't think that you're still in this game. I'm gonna do oh, everything. Oh, through the stage. I, I did not know that it could it I could go either. through like I that. I had no that. idea. It's very Pac-Man is so weird. <laughs> He's such a wonky character. Yeah. But Gives very him cool. With the citrus. And he's just, just gonna keep throwing these fruits. Apparently Mario's missing out on his vitamins, unlike his doctor counterpart. Pac Man's just trying to <laughs> Yeah, he's just doing what he can. He's like, listen, Ooh. Look, there's nothing in mushrooms. Yeah. Ooh. And the hydrant actually allowing uh, Uno to get a tilt. Oh my gosh, <coughs> and Matt definitely smashes. fishing for the up smash. Back throw is Probably gonna do it from like oh, oh and the back air will it. definitely take it out. Definitely, uh, Uno was a little careless to staying on the hydrant trying to charge Mario's back air. And when you're that high, you gotta watch out for it because it's quick, has good range. For sure. And at that at that point, it wasn't even stalled because he'd mostly been getting hit by just grab attacks. Yeah, exactly. So it was it was completely fresh. Mm. Yeah. So good stuff from Matt taking that game. I, I'd say fairly cleanly, and right, it looks just, like we're gonna get a, the Rob is gonna come out. He's just like, oh, I like this Pac-Man, but you yeah. know. Uh, yeah. Why and struggle? I, I think it's worth it. I mean, it didn't seem like he, even though he got the stock off, it, it, it like it felt like he was playing from behind like the whole game. So going Rob, getting a nice change of pace will probably do him some good. Yeah, after that first cape that took his stock super low, it just yeah. seemed like uh, <laughs> I don't, I don't like, want that to happen again. <laughs> absolutely. So the gyro is gonna be. There we go. Gyro disappears, so he's gonna get that back. This and matchup has to just be a hundred percent like Rob boxing Mario out with your. Yeah. Because once Mario gets in, you're going to see that. But yeah. you're going to see, next time he gets his hands on him, it's not going to be 0 to 20. It's going to be 20 to 70. Yeah, definitely. With all the up air strings. I mean, he definitely do he doesn't have the platform that would be re uh, really useful, like on Dreamland or Battlefield. But definitely Mario's grab combos are just potent on any stage. But regardless, he did a pretty good job of just stringing together some aerials to close the gap. Uh, um, this def oh, Ooh, and the F smash, landed. nice sweet spot, caught him right in okay. front of the face. will take out the first stock. And that was very good awareness seeing Matt coming in, just saying, hey, 
Oh! And he gets him right back. He's like, and before I even have a chance to completely compliment <laughs> Uno's kill, Matt matches it with his own, oh. and we have a dead even game. That's, that's just how Mario Rob works, because yeah. Rob, Rob is just a big body man. Yeah, he, I could see this being very volatile. It, it absolutely is, because like, yeah. there's even times when if Mario goes too low with his up B, Rob's down there completely covers a ledge, and Mario can't get around it. Yeah. I don't see enough Rob's do that. Yeah. But it's, it's, and it's real. Uno's... Oh, uh, and this might... Oh, uh, I think if he would have connected the up air, it probably would have taken the stock, it but regardless. Um, this next one, if he can connect it down through up airs, gonna take it out. But he's doing a phenomenal job with oh, this. Oh, that was such a nice yeah. gyro play, but uh. His gyro play, this game has, this, especially the second stock, has just been phenomenal. It feels like he's done, like, 90 damage just from the gyro. I like but it because it, it feels like he uses it as a zero lag area. Yeah. And a, uh, Matt, with a nice little up air string, is gonna close the gap. And up smash won't do it just yet, but the shield pressure oh. is very real. And that forward smash, def I mean, forward air definitely would have taken it out if it connected. So good stuff avoiding it. And now an up smash with the amount of rage that uh, Matt has will probably take it out. So Uno has to be very careful. And the up, air up throw will take it out, definitely. Okay. So he did a great job of just, like, yeah. staying outside that whole situation and just diffusing it. Like, we saw him get really zealous. Yeah. He got way too, like, oh, man, I need to get this now. I'm going to go in now. And that's yeah. what got him to 97%. Exactly. But at the end there, he was like, all right, maybe I don't want to lose. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> no, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Just take it easy. I mean, he w he was definitely he was completely aware, as I'm sure most players are, that uh, he was gonna go for the up smash. Yeah. So he was just like, oh well, you're gonna charge the up smash. I'm not gonna be an idiot and run I'm into that. Get that grab. Yeah, exactly. Over the tombstone pile driver. Yeah, exactly. I love that. I love that people gave it that name. I yeah. mean, I know where that's that from. That was all. But that was all Gunblade. Yeah. I think yeah. Gunblade made that. Oh uh, really? That's funny. Uh, but so I'm interested in seeing where Matt's gonna go um for game three. Uh. I don't really know where Mario would want to take Rob. I um I because like, anywhere with a low ceiling, you know, Rob is gonna benefit from that pretty well, uh, pretty like well, like similarly. I like Dreamland. You like as, Dreamland as Mario. As Mario. Uh, as Mario versus Rob because I, I play this matchup a lot, unfortunately. <laughs> uh, so I like Dreamland just because the platforms are a good height for me to not get poked through too hard, uh, and because falling against Rob as Mario can occasionally be a little tough. Mm. But we're gonna go to Battlefield, which yeah. is kind of the same thing. Yeah, gonna get the same platform layout, um, but with the uh, lower ceiling. I guess he wants to watch out for um, the down throw up air. Yeah. Um, but regardless, I mean, with with these platforms, uh, Uno is gonna have access to the pile driver on those platforms, so those could result in potentially earlier kills. We'll have for to see sure. how the match plays out. Um, but again, kind of the same theme. Uno doing a really good job of keeping him out with the gyro. Um, I need to see like. So every time Mario gets in, he just he's consistently pushing Rob to the edge of the stage, and like, yeah. that's not where you want to be because yeah. you'll see he's gonna get this four days. Rob is a big body. Yeah, it's exactly. hard to avoid those. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Um, but Uno did a pretty good job after like Matt got the initial like up air or whatever aerial. I think he got a back air, and uh, Matt tried to come for a grab, and he just poked out the jab to kind of stop it. But no, Matt is doing a really good job of like saying, okay, I don't have oh, my ground combos, wait. I can get you in the air. That way was so scary, like right before Uno got that laser in, mm. Matt was waiting for him. He was like, you yeah. think I'm going to forward air? No, mm. I'm going to wait here and forward smash when you air yeah. dodge. And Matt's... Okay. I got to go right now. All right. I speak up. It's actually, oh, it was dead even for a second now, but... Yeah. I mean, this is anybody's game... I don't think an up smash will do it just yet, but a couple more percent. Um, certainly now, yeah, an up smash will probably do yeah, it now. Yeah, for sure. This, that, um, that back there's not super dangerous, but off stage rub is not where you want to be because yeah. of that. Oh um, my god, that was really close. Yeah, it was. Oh, no punish on the whiff forward smash. I feel it's, like he was at a good height where he could have hit the platform with the. Oh! Oh, and Good job the on dodge. the wait for the spot dodge, but, but he's too it's high. too high. Yeah, the percent. Oh, and, and the pile driver, driver on the platform is going to do it. He's going to do it, okay. So. This is, this is, Uno is not going to try to take this yep. set line down after that Pac-Man game. Yeah, and he was able to actually nair out of the up air to stop Uno from, like, building up damage right away. But that is the beauty again, of Mario. Um, Uno is just doing a really good job of keeping him out. And he actually interrupts the up smash he with his own down legs. smash. He hits him I in the legs. You know, I didn't know that was possible. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's only Mario's head goes invincible. Yeah, I know. I was just joking. Yeah. <laughs> but regardless, um, good stuff. And he's just, he knows Matt's fishing for the kill. Oh, And there and it is. He gets it yeah. anyway. But 56% is pretty solid. 
He was doing a good job for a while, say, of um, keeping Matt out because he knew Matt was fishing for a kill, but now he's going to have to avoid the combos, which looks like are starting right now. Yeah, the problem is that he spent his jump <coughs> in the first up tilt. Like, that is not what you want to do when Mario gets you with the oh, up yeah, tilt. Oh, yeah, you just... Jump. Yeah. Just take, just take just, until you Yeah, can take the up tilts and then get out when you know you can get out instead of just trying to force it. Yeah, especially for Rob, because, like, once you have to fall and all you have is up B in there. Yeah, you're going to you're gonna have a bad time. Oh, yeah. Um, but, you know, it's kind of uh, getting Matt's percent up there. Um, I feel like an up smash will probably do the job now. We'll yeah. see what he can, um, he what he can work with. If he can and, trap him into it. And that was a really good job. I didn't know that Rob can just multiple down tilt and catch a spot dodge. And that was really good. Yeah, um, yeah he can catch a lot of, uh, And the down smash, oh, the sends battery. him the wrong way, yeah. Me, me Chibo, Ooh. and I, and Kurgan And this will do it. Nope. What? Yep, that, that will do it. it. Okay. Good stuff from Uno taking over SSB, Matt. Guys, it's been a pleasure, Beautiful. um, commentating for you. I gotta yeah. go play a match. Um, well... Yeah, yeah. Right. have a good, good luck with your match. Thank you. Yeah, that, that down smash is something special. I've, me and Chibo have spent hours in the lab. We've, we've talked to Kuragane about it. If you go to kuraganehammer.com, you go to Rob's page.